Hi, Timothy Hunker here. In this video, I'm going to talk about making your terminal look a little bit better, specifically through the use of themes. Now, there is a website, especially for uh, terminals that use the .x resources or the .x defaults file, like Xterm and XRVT Unicode, where you can create themes and copy built-in themes for your terminal. So let's go to that website. So the website is called terminal.sexy. Okay. So we'll go here. And what we can do is we can go and look through this scheme browser here. Okay. And we can look through base 16 themes, another collection of themes, and then xcolors.net themes. So let's move this over a little bit. And actually, let me just get rid of this. Leave this tab open. Okay. And let's say I wanted to, if I wanted to scroll down, and I wanted my terminal theme to be Monokai. I could click on Monokai and click Apply Scheme. And... I can then export the theme and if I want to use, now they have basically just X resources here. So this would uh, work for X term and uh, XRVT Unicode. So I'm going to export this and I'm going to just copy all this stuff now. That's copy all this. And what I'm going to do is bring back my terminal and I'm going to open I'm using XRVT Unicode, so I'm going to open the X defaults uh, file. Uh, you can use X resources and merge it. Uh, I find that X defaults XRVT Unicode will load that every time it starts up. So uh, I can go here, and here's the file. And you can see I already have another theme in here. But what I'm going to do is just delete all this stuff. So let's do uh, 20... Okay, and uh, this is some base stuff I have. Like it opens full screen here. I don't have a scroll bar. I have the tab bar and I have the font. Okay, but below that, what I'll do is I'll move down and I'll paste in this theme that I got from terminal.sexy. Okay, so what I'm going to do is now write this file. Okay, and I'll quit out of here and I'll close my terminal. And now when I open up the terminal, it's more of uh, a Monokai color, okay? Now, if I wanted to change it to something different, I can go back to terminal.sexy, and let's let's take a look at this collection. If we go down, I believe one of these has a material theme. Let's keep going. And here we go, we have a material theme. Okay, let's apply this color scheme. Okay, that's pretty cool. And let's export. We have to click export again. You, you may have noticed that these colors change. And now I'm going to copy this. Okay, go back to my terminal, open my X defaults. Okay, uh, let's go down here and just do delete these lines out. Go to insert mode, paste in my new colors. Close this out, close out my terminal, and if I restart it, I've got a material theme now going for me, okay? And there are plenty of themes here. You got plenty of base 16 themes. If you scroll down, you got this other collection here of themes. You've got Gotham. That's a nice dark theme. Uh, I got a bunch, Pretty and Pastel. Okay, that's interesting. This one also has a Monokai. It's a little bit different than the base 16 Monokai. Um, yeah, and there's a bunch here. Now, you could even do a matrix type theme, which is kind of cool. You can also just build your own theme here. Uh, if we want to go here and maybe change that a little bit, change the background and maybe make the foreground a little bit different. Okay, this is, this is a different theme now and you know we go in we start changing the colors here a little bit and you know we go through and uh, let's export this theme now 
and you can see some of these ch colors changed. So this is just my own made theme that was clicking around the color, color wheel here. Color wheel. And uh, let's open this up. And now let's go down here, uh, get rid of this stuff, and go and paste this in. And this, this may not turn out well because it was just made quickly, but let's load it back up. Uh, Okay, so that's that's my theme. It's not very good, uh, but you get the point. So you you can change themes with this website uh, terminal dot sexy, and make whatever theme you want for your terminal. I hope you found this video interesting. If you did, could you please give it a like, as it will help get out to more people. I also want to thank you for watching, and I hope to see you in the next one. Have a great day.